Hey JRT here and welcome back to another video. This gameplay you're about to see is Team Deathmatch on the map Mayday. Uh, my primary class is actually always my go-to class and the class that I, I just love to play with a lot now it is the MacTav 45 with a grip and quick draw. As far as my perks go, I'm using Ghost, Hardline, Tracker, Dead Silence, and Gung Ho. I find that Gung Ho is very useful when it comes to um, running and gunning. And my score streaks, of course, is UAV, Warden, and Advanced UAV. That seems to be the best way for me to achieve 70 or more kills. I've done this quite a few times now, spe specifically in Hardcore. I've done it in Core, but I don't play Core that much anymore. Mainly due to the lag in this game. The lag is just stupid. I tend not to get as much lag during the week, and I think the reason being is that the servers themselves are not near as clogged compared to the weekend and so I play great during the week and the weekends it tends to start to drag me down where I would shoot them but my bullets wouldn't count but all of a sudden they would turn and, and turn on me and shoot me which makes no sense whatsoever and that goes for hardcore and core anyway I go 75 and 10 in this game mainly due to my score streaks and everything else I highly recommend using the ward in a team deathmatch people don't realize that <laughs> blind eye a lot of people still don't use it's amazing and this game makes it so much easier too because blind eye pretty much counters every score streak except for of course maybe thor and uav and uh, support streaks like that but the rest of them it pretty much counters it's not like the other games where you have to use two different score streaks or two different perks to counter different score streaks whether ground score streaks or ai controlled score streaks something like that as far as the videos go, I didn't know, I've been pretty busy when it comes to um, school. I've been, I went back to school uh, earlier in January and it's hard getting back into things. I haven't had much time to make any of these small videos, but I wanted to go ahead and put it out there that I am going to stream almost once every weekend. And I'm going to try to put up one of these videos, I'm going to try to at least, once a week, these shorter videos. I have a lot of archived videos I wanted to show you guys just never had the chance to actually edit them I have hundreds of them really good videos and the next one I'll be putting up is a black ops 3 video which is just about knifing I get like 30 some odd kills just with a knife knife only not even using a specialist in black ops 3 I wanted to actually ask you guys a question what do you guys enjoy watching more you enjoy watching infinite warfare or black ops 3 more now black ops 3 when you go into hardcore the Hardcore modes are not as populated due to Infinite Warfare being out, and Kill Confirmed is almost nearly impossible to find a room. Uh, team Deathmatch is still relatively easy, and Domination you can find runes, but still a bunch of spawn trapping teams with padded stats. Uh, so it's, it's just not as fun as it used to be for Domination, but Team Deathmatch is definitely fun for me. As far as Infinite Warfare goes, it's the same thing with Infinite Warfare. Uh, I don't like playing Domination as much, but I think I'll go ahead and start giving it more of a try and playing uh, that as well as Kill Confirm. Kill Confirm kind of seems a little iffy. It doesn't seem near as fun as Black Ops 3 was. Earlier I mentioned about connection on Infinite Warfare. I want to go ahead and get into that. When it was talking about clogged up servers, a good example of that is look at Black Ops 3. If you try to go into Black Ops 3 now and play hardcore, there's not near as many players, right? Like I mentioned earlier. Well. Although there's not as many players, if you can get in a good match at Team Deathmatch, most of the time, now this is most of the time, I don't seem to have a problem with connection. Sometimes I do if it's early morning because not as many people are on, so it's desperate and trying to find those matches. So you may end up getting a three bar connection once in a while. Like, not you, but your enemy teammates might have three bars or two bars. Not necessarily you, but that makes it still difficult for you to play because they're skipping across the screen. But if you play in the afternoon, where the servers start getting a little bit more busy, now that the player base moved on to Infinite Warfare, I'd say roughly half the player base, maybe a little more, moved on to Infinite Warfare, I don't see near as much lag in Black Ops 3. And this has actually proven in Infinite Warfare that the servers themselves get clogged up, and as they get clogged up throughout the day, and I think the high times during the week is between anywhere between 4 and probably 10 those are the uh, peak hours because everybody's getting home and this is Eastern time for me 
so the servers start getting clogged up, I start getting more lag. But if I play in the mornings during the week, I don't get near as much lag. As far as the weekends, morning. Gotta play in the morning. I think once this hits about noon to one o'clock on the weekends, I say Saturday and Sunday. Friday's technically a weekend for me, but it applies to the weekdays. But Saturday and Sunday, if you play up until about noon or one, it should be fine. Um, sometimes during the evenings after seven, it starts to get a little bit better as far as connection wise on Infinite Warfare, but it's still pretty bad. So my question to you guys is where do you want to see more? Infinite Warfare or Black Ops 3? What do you guys like to see? For me, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to rotate weekends, like one week and I'll play Infinite Warfare, stream that, and then go into uh, Black Ops 3 the following weekend and just keep rotating out those weekends as I stream. And again, as far as the small videos go like this, I will be posting old gameplays where I'm not Master Prestige yet on Infinite Warfare and I will be posting old gameplays of Black Ops 3 that I never got a chance to put up. I did forget to mention that I am playing with one other player, his name is Your Dead Mister, and if, if you can hear the audio at all, we are talking throughout the video, but I never really, I decided to go ahead and turn it down because there is cussing involved. I really didn't want people to go ahead and hear that, but big shout out to your dead mister. I had a blast playing with him. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the gameplay, and as always, I'll see you next time. The fuck out of here. He had three fucking goddamn words. What do you want? <laughs> Good game, guys. Uh, hell no, nice man. Well what done. the fuck cheating shit you got over there? <laughs> I guess scale doesn't count, does it? Hell no, cause ain't no skill 75 and 10, hell no. I'm gonna help with that to my EC, that was pretty good. That was a pretty good game. We got a damage 100 in team deathmatch yet. You wanna know what I play with, it's my YouTube channel, man.